Well, it can be tough to forgive someone who's hurt you, but holding a grudge may be even harder on your health. In today's Health Minute, Steve Nanis explains that you might be doing more damage to yourself by holding on. Grudges or resentment are often described as poison, slowly weakening the person who cannot let go. But that's not just a metaphor. Some medical researchers believe it can take a toll on you physically. Johns Hopkins Hospital describes it as being in constant fight or flight mode. This causes constant changes to your heart rate, blood pressure, and immune system. When those three things are on a roller coaster, the rest of your body suffers. Psychologists say refusing to forgive and let go messes with your mental health as well. People who hang on to grudges are more likely to go through severe depression and PTSD. The good news is that you can change this behavior and ultimately your health. If forgiving others doesn't come easily for you, try practicing the reach forgiveness model, which the study says calms stress levels. Recalling the incident that hurt you, empathizing with the person who wronged you, thinking of forgiving that person as an altruistic gift, committing yourself to forgiving them, and holding on to that forgiveness without taking it back. One study published in the International Journal of Psychology suggests that the more you pray, the more forgiving you can become. But no matter how you're able to do it, remember, forgiveness is essential and will heal your heart in the process. For today's Health Minute, I'm Steve Nanis.